I ate Subway for seven days. That's an entire week. And they all started because of this Subway commercial. Guy changes his life by eating at Subway twice a day and walking a lot. Guy loses over 200 pounds. Yes, this Subway commercial is a reason why I decided to do this challenge for an entire week. And it started off with day one. Currently at work and it is one o'clock. It is my break time. About to have my two sandwiches for lunch. So I'm gonna be eating my two sandwiches here and when I get home, that's when I'm gonna go get my Subway meal. And that's gonna be my only meals for the day is just sandwiches. I we were doing my first cardio for the day. And I am finally done. Now we're of cardio done. Usually I do my workout before I start the day. So right when I wake up, but this morning there was a rain. I couldn't jog outside because Planet Fitness. I want to change the whole schedule. Now it's time to do some legs. Then it's time to finally eat a Subway. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even package so package so secured. Package secured at Subway. I'm back from Subway. Oh my, it's about time. Look at that. Before anything, first buy. Now I don't realize how happy I am to eat. This is Estrin Italian bread with steak, American cheese lettuce, cucumber, jalapeno, and mayo. You might be wondering, oh, I thought you were gonna eat um, Subway all day. Well, you see, I was gonna eat just Subway, but you see like, Subway is like $10 each foot long, and your boy can't afford it. I'm up here eating two sandwiches at work, so that should at least be something, because the two sandwiches are way healthier than the Subway. But it just matters how you make your Subway, because I'm making in mind, you know a healthier alternative which is gonna be like ham turkey steak chicken like either one of those that's how i'm gonna make it and that's how this challenge is gonna work if you keep getting a bunch of calories a bunch of sauces i mean it's just gonna build up and you're not gonna be in a caloric deficit each time i eat a subway it's not bad to treat myself with some chips Uh, uh, 50 percent less fat than the diet soda <sighs> I'm feeling satisfied I'm feeling positive for this challenge I'll let you know if anything right now my head hurts I have no idea I think it's because all I ate was two sandwiches and those two sandwiches were for like 400 calories and then I worked out before a 12 hour shift. So, just can't wait for my head to calm down. I'll see y'all tomorrow for day two. I finally got done. To be honest, I kind of feel, the right word to use, I feel healthy. Wow, yeah, that's the best way I could explain it. I feel healthy, but I'm also hungry. So I feel light, but now it's time to head back day. Two sandwiches. I'm that hungry. I be fasting, so I eat until one, which is my break. And how I feel about yesterday, I'm still hungry. I was so hungry since this morning, it feels like I didn't eat nothing. I guess that's the perk of eating healthier alternative foods. So here's my Subway. It's a meatball sub with marinara sauce and you know put some jalapenos in there it's my first time getting this sandwich um i was supposed to eat a lot better but i said screw it. it's a subway video eating seven subways in seven days and i just had two sandwiches so i have enough calories to eat it no chips this time right i'm gonna eat it then i'm gonna enjoy myself and then go to sleep because i have to pro proceed with the schedule tomorrow so let's just try it out y'all see y'all see it all right let's try it That's disgusting. I'm gonna eat it, but would I ever be getting this again? Hell no. I am hungry. See y'all for day three. For day three, it was a regular day. Did cardio, today was chest day. 
I forgot to film myself eating sandwiches at work, so I'm going to cut straight to just me eating my Subway sandwiches. Day 4 came, same thing, but today was leg day. I actually recorded myself eating my sandwiches at work and eating my Subway sandwiches. I'm back with the home workout. I'm on my treadmill, about to do my 65 minutes. Update, I've been feeling good lately. Like, I don't know why I feel like I've been dropping weight. I feel healthier for some reason. This challenge is pretty good. Like, I'm getting my full sleep now. You know, I'm eating my calories, under calorie deficit, enjoying my food that I'm eating, working out and feeling good. Uh, now I'm gonna get into my cardio session. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you No work, worked out, I fasted. Here I have it's three sandwiches. One for long and a half. I, I, I did eat the other half already. Didn't realize about recording it until now. I think I was just too hungry and focused. Chicken and buffalo. Bro, I'm telling you right now, this one's fire. The buffalo, it has like a stale type of spiciness, but it kind of hits right after. It's, it's good, it's good. Turkey sandwich. Mm. Mm -hmm. I ain't chips with that. Here I got is the, I think it has turkey, black forest, and salami inside. And that's what I'm on. It just tastes good. I've been feeling pretty good. See y'all for day six. I forgot recording myself to do any physical activity. So here's me eating my first Subway sandwich. And then here's me eating my second Subway sandwich. I'm not that hungry, but I'm just eating it to get my calories in. Final day, day seven. Doing my cardio session as always and getting straight to the point, which is eating my meal. Here we got a steak and cheese. Bro, for the last day, I'm going out with a bang, which probably isn't smart since I am trying to see how much weight I lose. Anyways, here we got something different is bacon. I'm baking Subway. That's actually good. Now together. With that being said, I really got nothing to say. I'ma just <laughs> enjoy my meal. And I'll see you for my second sandwich. I'm in my last meal for the day. I already ate the sandwich, but I forgot. I'm ending with a banger. It's a turkey oven tur turkey subway sandwich. I'm feeling like a million bucks out here. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow. Before I get to the most important thing, which is the weigh-in, I just want to mention this challenge was so refreshing. What I mean by that is because I know eating sandwiches may be boring, may sound boring, but dude, it was so good. Like you guys have no idea how much eating sandwiches was so good. I was eating in moderation, but let's get into the weigh-in. Before I started this challenge, I weighed myself and I came in weighing at 213 pounds. That's the whole reason why I started this challenge because I needed to drop some weight. Now, drum roll, ladies and gentlemen. I weighed myself after the challenge was over, which is an entire week, which was day seven. And I came in at weighing, put it down in the comment section down below. Before I say it, I came in weighing at 208.6 pounds. I lost 4.4 pounds. That's progress right there. You don't have to depend on the scale a lot, but for me personally, how I've been eating badly, eating over my deficit, this, is, this was a good result. And I know I would have been seeing a lot better progress if I did this for months and I actually stick to it. Let me know if y'all would want me to do that. Let's screw it. You know what is a lot of money? This is why I did it this way in the video because I don't got the funds to do it. But if y'all want to see that, let me know down below. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, thank you. I'll see y'all on the next one. Up next up, subscribe to this channel, man. Make sure to turn on the post notifications, man. Everything. Everything.
everything, all right?